In this video, we will show you how to enable users to subscribe to your WordPress blog. User subscriptions can be handled in many ways. In this tutorial, we will be discussing two common ways of subscription. One way to do so is by RSS feeds, while the other is by email subscriptions. Let us begin with the RSS feeds method first. First of all, you need to go to feedburner.com. Over here, sign in with your Google account. Once you've signed in, a welcome page will open up. In the welcome page, type your blog's address under the field titled Burn a Field Right This Instant. Once you're done, click on the Next button. With that done, another page will open where you will be asked to identify your feed source. Choose the first option and click on the Next button. As a result, a new page will open up. Here you can modify your feed's title and address. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will leave it as it is. Click on the Next button to proceed further. In the new page, you will be congratulated and will be displayed with your feed's address. Simply copy the address and sign in to your dashboard. When the dashboard opens up, move your mouse over to Plugins and click on the Add New button. In the search field, type Social Profiles widget before you click on the search button. You will get a list of widgets in the search results. Choose the one by the writer Nathan Rice. Click on the Install Now button. You will be displayed with a confirmation message. Click on the OK button to proceed. Once the installation has completed, click on the Activate Plugin option. After that, you will be displayed with a confirmation message about the activation of the plugin. Now move your mouse over to Appearance and choose Widgets. With that done, find Social Profiles under the available widgets and click on Add. Now give a suitable title to your widget and paste the address given by FeedBurner under RSS slash FeedBurner URL. Once you're done, click on the Save Widget button. Now visit your blog and you will notice the RSS feed icon and the title you gave to the widget. Click on the icon and a new page will open where you can see your blog's feed. This was all about the RSS method. Now we will teach you about the email subscription method. For this, you will have to open feedburner.com and sign in with the same account you used for the RSS method. Here a page will open up where you will be displayed with your feed and your blog title. Click on your blog title. As a result, a new page will open up. Over there, click on Publicize tab and under Email Subscriptions, click on the Activate button. With that done, another page will open up. Scroll down to the bottom and copy the code under Preview Subscription Link. Now go to your dashboard and open Widgets under Appearance over there. From the available widgets, find the Text widget and click on the Add button. With that done, the Text widget will open up. Give it a suitable title which you want your visitors to see. Next, paste the copied link in the text field and save the widget. Now visit your blog and you will notice the email subscription link. Click on the link and a new page will open up where visitors can subscribe to your blog after entering their email addresses.